the Los Angeles Lakers made significant adjustments to their starting lineup, opting for Jared Vanderbilt in place of D'Angelo Russell for their recent game against the Oklahoma City Thunder, which they clinched with a 129-120 victory. While LeBron James, Anthony Davis, Torian Prince, and Cam Reddish retained their starting roles, this tactical change aimed to reinforce the team's defensive prowess. Emphasizing our defensive capabilities was the rationale behind this alteration, remarked Coach Ham, addressing the decision before the game. When we excel defensively, it tends to facilitate our offensive plays. So, our intent was to prioritize that aspect and begin with a slightly larger lineup. Vanderbilt made a modest contribution, tallying two points, six rebounds, one steal, and one block in his 24-minute stint, while Russell, coming off the bench, amassed 15 points, one rebound, and three assists within 17 minutes. However, this shift in the lineup coincides with potential setbacks in the Lakers' guard rotation. Gabe Vincent, recently back after a seven-week hiatus due to knee swelling, might undergo an arthroscopic procedure on his left knee. Sources revealed to ESPN that this surgery could potentially sideline him for six to eight weeks, with swelling reoccurring after his return against the Chicago Bulls and subsequently causing his absence in the games versus the Minnesota Timberwolves and Thunder. An official decision regarding Vincent's procedure is anticipated by Sunday as the Lakers prioritize his health and well-being. Coach Ham emphasized the need to ensure Vincent's full recovery before considering alternative strategies for the team. Furthermore, Russell's transition to the bench realigns him with Austin Reeves in the backcourt, a pairing that showed promising chemistry during the initial eight games of the season. <laughs> Austin and D'Lo have shown strong on-court synergy together, Ham explained. This adjustment in our rotations provides a faster, more offensive approach. I'm eager to witness the impact of both lineups, the starting unit's early game pressure, and the versatility we gain through substitutions. The Lakers had been on a challenging stretch, losing their preceding four games before this crucial win. The team's record since winning the in-season tournament in Las Vegas stood at 2-5. Anthony Davis had labeled the Thunder matchup as a pivotal must-win contest.